Hmm. Hmm. Wow. Wow. Oh, I remember now. I didn't like it. Yeah. Ooh, I like that one. Ooh. Welcome back to Love and Junk Food. I'm Laura. I'm John. And today we have an exciting oh, episode yes. for all of you, or for all of us, I yes, should say. for all of us, for sure. Uh, this is figuring out what is our favorite British drink. Yes. Or at least of the ones that are before us. So we've tried, hmm, have we tried all of these? I want to tell them the truth. I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, I think we've tried a majority, maybe five out of the seven. Okay. And so today we are going to give you a definitive answer. What is our favorite? Because we'll try one and then sometimes it's months and months and months before we find another one or get another one sent to us. So these are the ones we have for today. I'm sure we're missing a lot of them, but these are the ones that we could find in our local British shop. And by local, I mean three hours away. <laughs> so there's that. There's we that. have Orangina. Yes. Lilt. Yep. Dandelion and Burdock. Vimto. Ribena. Iron Brew. And R. White's Premium Lemonade. Have we tried that one? I think so. Then but I, I can't remember. Then it's I been feel a while. like we've tried all of them, maybe. Have we tried I Lilt? I don't know, Anna. <laughs> and I don't know if we tried the. Orangina. I don't know. Uh, we have <laughs> lots of our friends uh, watch a lot of our videos yeah. and um, they'll probably be able to tell us what we've tried. I know for a fact we've tried Iron Brew, yes. Ribena, but it wasn't in this little juice box thing. No, it was the um, squash, the yeah. concentrate. Yeah. yeah. I know we've tried Vimto. Yeah. I know we've tried Dandelion Burdock. The other ones... I don't know. The Vimto we tried looked different though. It was in a can, it was fizzy, but it was like red, I think. Yeah. A red can, yeah. So, I don't know. Uh, Here it goes. We're gonna tell you what our favorite one is. So, which one do you wanna start with? Do you wanna start at one end and just work our way or what? All right, let's start, start with our White's Premium Lemonade. Okay. In the can. I'm gonna give it a sniff. Yes. The old sniff test. Doesn't really smell like lemonade. I can smell a thing. It just smells like a, a Sprite or something like that. Let's see, color check. No color. Okay. Yeah, it just, it honestly just smells Cheers. like Sprite. Hmm. Wow. Wow. I wonder how close it is to Sprite came out with Limonade mm -hmm. or something like that this year. Was it Limonade? I don't know. We tried it on the channel. I can't remember. It's similar to that. It's kind of like a lemon lime soda. Yeah. That's more lemon, right? Yeah. I like the lemon flavor of it. Mm -hmm. um, there's a... Um, Something different with it though, and it's not an, a bad flavor, it just seems a little odd. And maybe it's real lemons. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> well, also, it's not no shade because I love American sweet soda that we're used to, but it's not that really artificial, super sugary lemonade in a can that yeah. we're used to, which I also love, but yeah. it's not that. I, and I like that. I, I like that. It's I do like too. That. Um, I, I really kind of hate super, super sugary sweet uh, drinks. Drinks. Yeah. Uh, anymore. So All I, right. I like that it's toned down a little bit. All right. That's the one to beat. As of right now, that's my favorite. All right. Iron Brew. Let's Iron do it. I brew. feel like it was either Iron Brew or Vimto or both that I absolutely love because it was sweeter. Yeah. And almost had like a candy vibe to it for me. I remember uh, really liking Ribena. Okay. All right. Cheers. 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 
You can tell the color. Orange. That's the one. That's the one? It Because it has such a unique flavor, and I don't know how to describe it. I absolutely love the flavor of Iron Brew. Does it say? No. Carbonated flavored soft drink. That's what it says. Um, don't know what the flavor is other than Iron Brew flavor. Um, it tastes, it has a taste to it that, to me that's similar to some like energy drinks. A little mm -hmm. bit. Little if bit. you are like me and you like baby bubbles, like I know our friend Janice doesn't like the uber carbonated, yeah. you know, like Coke and stuff, I always say is like hard bubbles. This is not like that. It's uh, fizzy, right. but very, very subtle bubbles. I love the flavor of it. I kind of wish it had a little bit more bubbles. But. I think it's perfect as <laughs> is, and it is my number one now. Nice. It is my number one as well. So okay. it has taken the lead from okay. our whites. Okay. So time for a little drink box. Yeah. Made with real juice, a Ribena, black currant. Nice. Rich in the vitamin C. Nice. Hey. <laughs> Let's wow, that was a lot easier to, than a Capri Sun. Is it Ribena or is it Vento? I don't know why I'm looking at him and asking him. Yeah. I mean that look at you and ask you. Is isn't there one of them or both? That you can get it as a fizzy drink and get it as a squash. Is that Vimto? I think Vimto is like that. Yeah, no. Ribena. Not sure. Possibly. I, I feel like I like it. Um, I wonder, can you get it with bubbles? I feel like that would be fun with bubbles. Or like cut it with like spray and yeah. some of that like some people do with juice. Um, I like it. I don't love it better than Iron Brew though. Iron Brew is still my number one. Yeah, I think Iron Brew is my number one still as well. Um, I remember when we first tried Ribena and it was the squash or the concentrate, we didn't know that it was. And I remember we tried it straight and I just thought it was just like grape juice. That was, I mean. <laughs> because was, it was so sweet, like our grape juice. It was, but, and so now that, and then we fixed it and we tried it as, you know, you should, but, um, that tastes kind of watered down to me. Like, I remember we, when we tried it, it was so strong before. Well, obviously, I was supposed to have how many gallons of water added to it. <laughs> um, I think that's the only one that we have that's not a fizzy drink, right? I so think it kind so. of um, stands on its own. We'll see if there's another one that isn't fizzy, but I. I mean, there's the Iron Brew, too. But that's fizzy? Sort of. All right, Iron Brew, number one still for me. Yeah, me too. Okay. Let's do the Vimto. Here you go. I will let you pour your own. Oh, I like the smell of that too. There's the color. Looks like lots of bubbles. Uh, I'll just use the can. Okay. There you go. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Oh. I remember this flavor from when we tried Vimto before. Oh, now we have a problem. <laughs> I I feel like in my bones now it's going to come down to Vento versus Iron Brew. Are we honorary Brits now? <laughs> uh, I love this one. By now one. I think we should. Mm, I don't think I'm going to like this one better. This one, I Maybe. think I... I think I will, but I feel like that's more similar to soda that we can get. There is nothing, nothing that tastes like this. No. How do you describe Vimto to somebody that's never had it? It's like, I don't know, drinking chewing gum kind of? <laughs> yeah, that's why I love it. It is sweet, but it's not crazy, uber, sickening sweet. Right. But it is sweeter than like Ribena. Well, it's sweeter than... Um, the first lemonade thing for sure. Yeah, the R White. It I, has such a unique flavor. I, I am really liking this. Um, the fizzy vento, you know. Yeah. I really like that, and I, I'm trying to picture it, um, not fizzy, you know. Yeah. 
I like it. I I love that. I think it's taken over my number one. I'm going to reserve Okay. that I I think it's going to be Vimto then Iron Brew, but I'm going to I'm going to Sorry. Wait till the end and see where we end up. All right. Okay. Dandelion and burdock. I remember. Didn't I feel like I liked it, but I don't know that I loved it. Is that? Do I remember it right? I don't know. Um, I can't remember. Interesting. Do you remember if you liked it? Uh, I think I liked it, but I don't know that it was my favorite. Oh yeah, it looks really dark, and I feel like I offended people when I said the closest thing we have to it is root beer. Oh, right. I mean, you have to, if we're telling an American what yeah. it's like, we have to go by things that we've had before. I feel like, I don't know, let's try it. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, I remember now. I didn't like it. Yeah. <laughs> it's got like licorice -y vibes. Yes. But, and yeah, I John really didn't don't like, like it. That. Yeah. Yes. I like it, I don't love it. Um, it does feel like a very old fashioned flavor. Like, mm -hmm. yes. That like, I don't know what the heck sarsaparilla is, but I, <laughs> but I picture it being like root beer, sarsaparilla, this kind of thing, like very old vintage flavors. It's strong, it tastes like licorice. Yeah. Um, it's fizzy. There you go. That's what it is. Uh, I like it, like I said, but I, and that, that, that's not my number one, for sure. Yes, for sure. Okay. Lilt. In fact, I'm going to move my cup on over here. It, you know what it reminds me of? What? Jägermeister. Oh, <laughs> I'm glad you said that after she swallowed. If you've had Jaeger before, you know what I mean. That's one of those things you can easily get triggered by. <laughs> yes. Lilt. All right. I see a picture of a pineapple and an orange. On yeah. There. Oh, yeah. I'm going to like this. Our friend Anna likes it. I know. She mentioned it recently. I don't know. That's. I should probably try it. Can I try it from the can? Absolutely. Because I just had dandelion and burdock in it. <laughs> oh, yeah. I can tell by the smell. Ooh, I like that one. Ooh, I like that one too. Wow. It kind of tastes like Sprite or like 7-Up or one of those kind of drinks. Yeah. With pineapple juice mixed in. Yeah. Ooh, I like it. I mean, it's just like a slightly fizzy orange and pineapple. It's delicious. It's, it's like super good. Oh, does that come in like zero sugar or diet version? That I could see replacing my regular like Diet Mountain Dew. Like if we lived in the UK, I think that would be my regular soda. Yeah. Because as much as I love Vimto and Iron Brew, um, as specific as the flavor is, I don't know that I would want to drink that exclusively. Do you know what I'm saying? Yes. Lilt is it. Lilt is it. I think Lilt has taken over my number one spot. Really? Yes, I think so. But we'll wrap up here in a minute. All right, let's see. I love the bottle. Does yeah. it always come like this? That's oh, really there's... cool and interesting. Floaties. I hope they're supposed to be there. <laughs> Open sesame. Is there a picture on there? Interesting color. Interesting smell. I don't know what to say. <laughs> it smells like. I don't. <laughs> what is it? I mean, it kind of tastes like orange. It Wait. kind of tastes like grapefruit. Shake the pulp. Of course, it says that upside down. I <laughs> <laughs> it does kind of taste like grapefruit and orange, like a combination. It's not fizzy. No. 
or if it's supposed to be, it's very, very subtly fizzy. I love the bottle. I like the flavor. That wouldn't be a new favorite for me, but, I, right. but it's decent. Yeah, yeah. There's nothing wrong with it. I can't tell you why it's not one of my favorites. I just don't like it as much as some of the other ones, right? Yeah, and it makes me wonder, is this like a, is it like a, like a breakfast thing or like a, for a drink for any time or, you know, like. You mean it kind of reads juicy? Juicy, yes. Yeah. That's what I mean to say. Uh -huh. yeah. Me too. I don't, I don't know. I don't think, I think it's supposed to be just like a regular whatever. pop or soda or fizzy drink yeah. or whatever. Um, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I don't, I don't know how I feel about that one. I, uh, I like it. I'll come around to where it fits in here okay. in a second. Are you ready to rank and yes, rate? Yes, yes, yes. Do you want to go first? I... I have to go back in history here for just a second. Ugh. Whoa. Do you need to? Uh, no, I don't think I do. I think I, I got it down. Okay. Where's the end going to be? Over by you? The end is wherever, yeah, sure, start on. This was my least favorite. Really? Only because, and there again, there's nothing wrong with it. I don't really know why I'm saying that. Other than there's nothing special yeah. about it, you know, yeah. Yeah. to me. Um, hmm. I honestly really liked them all. I mean, I like this one. It just is my least favorite of this group, you know? Yeah. Um, then I'm going to do dandelion burdock i liked it licorice that black licorice flavor isn't my favorite but i enjoyed it then i'm gonna say ribena this ribena today um then this one again it depends on what you compare it to then lilt then Iron Brew. Well, the Vimto wins Vimto. out for you. Now, Woo! I want to say a couple of things. One, Lilt would be hands down my everyday soda. Yeah. Because I couldn't, I don't think I would drink, you know, like right now, I don't always drink mm. like grape soda or orange soda. It would be like, this would be my regular. And then when I want something different, I would pick up one of those. That's yeah. kind of how. I see that. I, I could see it. I would roll. I would buy any of them. Again, I would be happy if you sent us any of them again. But as far as like purchasing on the regular, I would probably cut that off here. Mm -hmm. This I would try if somebody gave, I mean, you know, have one if somebody gave it to me, but I don't think I would crave that flavor. Right, right. All right, I am going to switch it up <laughs> I a knew. little bit. I knew he would. <laughs> switch it up a little bit. And then I need to switch this up a little bit. And then switch it up again. Um, so my favorite is the Lilt. My least favorite, Dandelion and Burdock. None of that's surprising yeah, to not, me. Not sure uh, if you're surprised by that or not. Uh, the Ribena comes in like, I don't know, where it's at right now because, um, I don't know, I just don't like this juice box version of it. I think okay. it needs to be a little stronger. And if we had the squash, we could mix make it, it ourselves. Stronger. Yeah, yeah, whatever we want. But yeah, the lilt was delicious. I love the Vimto. The Iron Brew is, is wonderful. And the R Whites, really, I would get any of these again. And I would get a Ribena flavor, just not this particular version. I would get the Orange Iron again, just not the Nail Lion Burdock. That's the only okay. one. Ribena too, if you're interested and you're not from the UK, we've seen Ribena flavor in candy before yes, and, yeah. and other things. So do they do that? Maybe with Vimto too, I feel like there's been Vimto mm. gummies or something else. I don't know. Let us know. Um, oh, yeah. you know I think we comments. did try some of that. I yeah. feel like we did. So anyway, this was really fun. Did it turn out how you thought? Uh, you know us if you've been watching for a while. You know what our taste buds are like. Did you guess our favorites um, and our least favorites from the start? We uh, we love our subscribers from everywhere. I feel like there is a 
um, a special bond with the people in Canada. We visited Canada before. Yeah. We can't wait to go back. They're our close neighbors. Um, I feel like we've got a few watchers in Australia and mm -hmm. that touches my heart so much because you're so far away and I, yeah. you know, I, it's like we live in the middle of the country. We're not a big city. We're not a big channel and yet we have people from all over the world watching us, which makes me feel so very blessed. Yes. Um, of course we love the people that are here in the U.S with us too yep. but we do have a very special bond with all of our subscribers that are in the uk that are always sending us things mm -hmm. and are so tickled when we try things from there um your love and support means so very much to us so thanks for hanging out with us guys uh we have a whole playlist if you're new of we have over 100 videos of us trying things from the uk so we will put that down in the pin comment speaking of the pin comment we will have links where you can subscribe to this channel and our other channels where we do other things. Um, our socials will be on there. Um, I don't know. What else? That's it. That's pretty right. much. Our address, yeah. if you're That's curious right. about that. Uh, now, if you love dandelion and burdock, or orangina, mm -hmm. or ribena, or R. White's lemonade, iron brew, vimto, or lilt, or have any interesting little factoids <clears throat> or information, information or which on, one you like. Yeah, on any of this stuff, we would love to hear in the comments. That's all we have for today. That's it, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye.